we've arrived at the summit of Japanese animation. Are you planning on continuing our fight anytime today? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 anime of all time. <laughs> Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking through the entirety of anime history to see which series stands out as the very best. And if you haven't already, be sure to check out our best anime by decade series. You can do anything here, because this is your world. Number 10, Fate Zero. While there was a Fate Stay Night anime back in 2006, Fate Zero is what really made us fans of the franchise and set the stage for future titles. I ask you. <laughs> Are you worthy to be my master? The stage is set for the battle to obtain the Holy Grail, an item that grants the victor any wish they desire. This series features a cast of interesting, well-developed characters, each with their own motivations for wanting the Grail, and each with fantastical abilities captured in brilliantly choreographed fight scenes. It's hard to believe that something this epic started as a hentai game. Number 9, Gintama. Speaking of retellings of the Edo period, this might just be one of the funniest. Aliens are on the attack, and the Shogun bravely surrenders when he realizes they can't win. This leads to the aliens taking all of the samurai's swords, and the Edo period getting a futuristic makeover where old forcibly meets new. Perfectly timed comedy combined with this crazy premise makes this one of the most hilarious series of the decade, which can also be surprisingly touching at times. Number 8, Legend of Galactic Heroes. Based on the science fiction novels by Yoshiki Tanaka, this anime tells the story of battle between the Galactic Empire and the Free Planets Alliance. We watch the development and growth of two men, Reinhard von Lohengram of the Galactic Empire and Yang Wen Li of the Free Planets Alliance. The series shows each of their stories, which makes you understand where both are coming from in their goals and ideals. It's not just the battles that make this series memorable, it's the participants of the war and the harsh realities that are presented throughout. Number 7, Neon Genesis Evangelion. You don't watch this show, you live it. Ask any anime fan, and they'll tell you exactly when they experienced Ava. I can't pilot that thing! If you're going to do it, do it now. If not, then leave. And if you happen to be one of the 1% who hasn't gotten to know Shinji and why he needs to get in the damn robot, we're pretty sure someone is going to strap you down and teach you the gospel of NGE. This series is a metaphor of sorts for Shinji growing up, complete with religious symbolism, a bunch of mecha, and that awkward teenage chemistry that we all try our best to forget. <laughs> this was an undisputed masterpiece. Number 6, Stein's Gate. <laughs> Time travel isn't the easiest phenomenon to tackle, but this anime series manages to capture it perfectly. That concludes my reasoning with regard to the quantum view. Unless, of course, the gentleman would like to point out something I missed. Feel free to jump in, sir. No! 
Why must she be so damnably articulate? Sure, the power sounds great in theory, but it can be confusing and painful to deal with, especially if you're trying to save someone you care about. My text traveled backward in time. What? That's the feeling we get as we watch the self-proclaimed mad scientist, Rintaro Okabe, travel back multiple times in an attempt to save someone close to him. Please, no. I'm begging you. Watching him go from eccentric to desperate is quite the dizzying ride, but you're still rooting for him to succeed. <laughs> Number five, Gurren Lagann. That's the surface. I told you there was a surface up there. Have you ever watched an anime series that gave you goosebumps every single episode? <laughs> That's our number two pick. Forced to live underground, our lead character Simon often leans on his best friend Kamina, who has dreams of visiting the surface world. We're gonna combine. We're gonna combine. They're gonna combine. They're gonna combine. They're gonna combine. Oh please, honey. <laughs> When Kamina convinces Simone to kick Reason to the curb and join him, things get a bit outlandish, and all of that bizarre mecha craziness is highlighted with a wild and colorful animation style. Some of the best that Gainax has to offer. Human scum! No dirty tricks, you little- ah! What else can we say but row, row, fight the power. What foolishness. You would risk the universe for the sake of a fleeting emotion. You're wrong, dumbass! I'll protect them! The girl! The universe! Both of them! Number four, One Piece. As stated in our Best Of series, One Piece is an anime titan that simply cannot be defined by a single decade, but it is certainly one of the greatest of all time. Standing out as the best-selling series in Japan, and also earning insurmountable success in the greater world, The Adventures of Monkey D. Luffy and the Straw Hat Pirates has kept the masses pondering all the big mysteries. What is the One Piece? Who will be the King of the Pirates? Will this series ever end? Well, probably not, but we're not complaining. Number 3, Dragon Ball Z. Don't you come any closer! Look, I'll use this thing! Sure, the series started in 1989, but it only really got going in the 90s. Let's face it, this was THE action anime of the 90s, even with its laughable edits. Even non-anime fans know who Goku was, regardless of whether or not it was about that generalization of him having a strong set of lungs from all that yelling. This series was less about finding the Dragon Balls, and more about rooting for your favorite Z fighter. Years later, we're still rocking the dragon. <laughs> Number two, Cowboy Bebop. You always gotta start it off with Tank. Ah, Bebop, the perfect anime to introduce people to the medium and show them that anime was more than mature-rated stuff that aired on late-night television. In a decade where anime was starting to make headway in the US, it was easy for people to label it as kinda weird. But Bebop hit all the right notes with its fun characters, slick animation, phenomenal music, and a plot that was really easy to get into. What's wrong if you don't comply? As stylish as it was entertaining, what else can we say but see ya, Space Cowboy? Before we get to our number one pick, let's pull these honorable mentions off of our shelves. What if someone else had picked up this notebook? Is there anyone out there other than me who'd be willing to eliminate the vermin from the world? But you'll die! I don't mind. Don't be an idiot! An old friend of mine always used to tell me that. He'd say I was a fool. It's my weakness, I guess. Number one, Full Metal Alchemist, Brotherhood. <laughs> 2003, we were thrust into the world of alchemy, where the rule of equivalent exchange governs all. You can play that game. 
The series took us through a gauntlet of emotions with the Elric brothers, and in the end, we kinda liked the ending. Always remember we allowed you to live. Few people expected the series to be rebooted, especially after just five years. <laughs> With Brotherhood following the manga closer, we get an even greater story to digest. New characters, more fluid fight scenes, and more heart-crushing plot points. <laughs> we are the same! We're the same! You're just like me! We're not! Oh, but yes we are! The opportunity was right in front of us and we took it! This was definitely the definitive version of the series to watch, and what could arguably be one of the greatest stories ever told. There you are. Very well done, Alphonse Elric. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.